What's going on guys, this is Leo Guild Wars and today I'm just going to talk about the new farming spot for Skelt. And this is after the nerf edition, so after ArenaNet did nerf the Skelt location in South Sun Cove, there is an instance, or a mini dungeon, let's put it that way, where you can just constantly keep farming Skelks and I wanted to test this out to see how much gold you would get. And on average you will get four, roughly 4 gold an hour, 4 or more, it, depend it depends on, you know, if you find more rares than usual or if you find salt sun crates but in this video I didn't find much rares or salt sun crates so I do know that four gold is the minimum that you will get from this technique and it's almost on par with the scalp farming spot before the nerf although you don't get the buff from the NPC you don't get the 200 magic find buff so it's gonna be more gear related what I did in this video is I stacked MF gear I roughly got like 150 it's, it's not too much much and it's doable as long as you're able to kill the skulks you're pretty much golden and what you do is you farm away you just keep entering the dungeon and then you just run to the spot but usually what I do is I would turn around and I'd fall onto the broken shipwreck and then from there I just go in there and just wreck the skulks and you'll find a pretty hefty amount of powerful bloods and vicious claws that's probably what you're aiming for I roughly made three gold and 80 silver in this video I probably found five powerful blood I believe and eight vicious claws in total that's not too much and it's not too bad compared to the nerf that they did yeah I really like this method it's it's not tedious at all because you're sitting in one spot talking to the NPC to go into the dungeon once you go in there you just farm the skulks once you're done killing the skulks you just leave and rinse and repeat I find it's pretty easy I'm not too sure if you can do it on low levels but by all means you can try it out because I believe you are upscaled in South Sun Cove and as you can see I don't have all the clips for the one hour farming because imagine fitting one hour into I think four minutes but yeah just watch the rest of the video at the end I'll have a breakdown on how much gold I made. The start time was 3.24 I believe and the end time is going to be 4.24 obviously. One hour. Now for everyone that wants to try this out or test it out by yourself, you guys can. You only have two days though because this instance is only going to be open till June 11th I believe. And what you're going to do is you're just going to port to Pearl Islet and talk to Ellen Keel. She's she's by the she's by the NPCs where you get the, the buff from. Like the MF buff and the gold find buff. She's right there. You talk to her and it's a repeatable story instance so you can keep doing this over and over until DR hits you hard. <laughs> So the end time we stopped at is 4.24 p.m. and we started at 3.24 or 23. So we were just above the time by one minute, but it's roughly one hour that we farmed. And the end gold that we came up with is 12 gold and 94 silver and 38 copper. So this is just the amount of gold that we got from the monsters or we looted from the monsters. And as you can see, my inventory is like pretty packed. Uh, what you're going to really notice is we got five vial of power powerful blood and eight fishes claws which those are the t6 mats that you make money from or for all those people that are trying to collect the t6 mats for the legendary this is a great way to farm and yeah i'm just gonna have a nice little breakdown right after this you're gonna see all the price values of all the stuff i found and the total that we get is it was three gold and 80 silver i believe but you, you can double check i'm pre-recording this without looking <laughs> smart right so yeah i hope you guys enjoy this video um i hope it's really educational you can try this instance out you only have two days to farm the skelks and yeah just let me know if you guys like it if you don't uh, feel free to put another area that you love farming and by all means i'm just trying to help you guys out so hope you guys have a good farming day leo guild Wars, over and out